Hey guys, Andrew from Cable Bullet here, and today I wanna to show you how to install our post side handrail brackets. These brackets are really great for when you wanna do a single post transition down a set of stairs. Let's get into it. Thanks for being here with us. We regularly produce product overviews, how-tos, and instructional videos, so please consider subscribing to our channel if you find this video helpful. With that out of the way, let's talk about our post side handrail brackets. This bracket was designed with our signature series posts and matching handrail in mind, but it can be mounted to just about any surface and is also compatible with any handrail that has a flat underside. We have four screws for mounting to a metal surface and handrail, and two screws for mounting to a wood surface, as well as a set of nylon washers if you're going through drywall. Our brackets are made from T316 stainless steel here in the US, so they're long lasting and maintenance is a breeze. Now let's take a look at mounting these brackets. Mounting the brackets is a relatively simple process, but will likely require an extra assistant when you need to mount your handrail. First, secure the bracket to your post or whatever surface you're going into, and then attach your handrail. We recommend practicing once or twice on some scrap pieces before going into your actual piece. If you can, try to practice on something that's angled. To mount your brackets to drywall, you need to be anchored into a stud, so first you need to find that. Next, set your bracket in place and mark the first hole. Remove the bracket and then drill a half inch hole into the drywall and place a nylon washer. With the washer in place, go ahead and tentatively set the bracket with one of the provided wood screws. You'll need a T20 bit to drive the screw in. Just make sure that you leave enough room so you can adjust your bracket as needed. Now, make sure your bracket is level and mark the second hole. Repeat the previous step of drilling a half inch hole and placing a washer, and then set your second screw. For installation on a Cable Bullet Signature Series post, first position the bracket where you need it to be and clamp it in place. Use a speed square to help keep the bracket level. Drill your first pilot hole with the 532nd inch drill bit and secure the bracket with a single number eight by one and one quarter inch mounting screw. Remove your clamp and check to make sure your bracket is still level and then secure your second mounting screw. Make sure you're driving your screws in by hand to keep them from stripping. If you are running your handrail between posts or columns, you'll need to repeat this process on the other side with a second bracket. With our brackets installed, we're now ready to mount our handrail. To demonstrate this process, we're going to be using our Signature Series aluminum handrail. If you're using a custom handrail, the tools and steps necessary might be slightly different. Be sure to check with our customer support team if you have questions specific to your handrail. To prevent side-to-side -side movement, secure your handrail in place with a clamp. With your handrail on the bracket, have an assistant apply firm downward pressure as you mark your two screw locations through the underside of the bracket with a 532nd inch drill bit. Just go in enough to give yourself a guide mark. If possible, try to secure the other end of your handrail to make this process easier. For ease of access, we recommend removing the handrail at this time and finishing your pilot holes separately. Complete those pilot holes with the 532nd inch drill bit. If your handrail is running at a slope, make sure you're drilling parallel with the bevel cut. Lastly, attach your handrail to the mounting bracket by hand using a screwdriver and the included mounting screws. There you have it, an elegant low profile bracket to mount your handrail. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions about our mounting instructions or need assistance with your project, be sure to contact our customer support team or visit us at cablebullet.com. Thank you.